guys welcome back to my channel it's me Des, and I'm here with another video for you today we have uh, yet again another Timu haul because you know your girl can't resist so I have quite a big one today I have opened the bag ready because it's quite a large one it's substantial I'm trying to rescue you from all the chins on show at once I think I may have found an angle where my chins aren't so prominent for you guys so you know like your girl's gonna try and rock this angle. Um, if you are new to my channel and you think my content might be relatively funny, you enjoy my sense of humor, all the hauls or all the stuff that I buy, then please give us a, a like or a thumbs up, whatever you wanna call it on here. And a subscribe goes a long way. And if you are one of my regular subscribers, much love to y'all, cause you won't need it with me. So let's get into the haul, what I've got today. It is quite big, but it's mostly boxes. So, okay. So the first thing that fell out of the box was this package here. It's not actually really that damaged to be fair. I was expecting it to be like super damaged because sometimes the boxes are. So I'm gonna get into the box. <laughs> well, I'm going to try and get into the box. We'll see. Oh, that was smooth. I'm using one of these eyebrow tools because I don't really want, like, scissors and stuff hanging around. I know, like, yeah, Des just put them away afterwards, but I know what I'm like. With this, guaranteed it will be put straight back. I won't use it for my eyebrows now, though. I'll just use it for box opening. Oh, Okay. Ooh. So it's come packaged well. Oh, okay. So I think I ordered this for like some of the pieces for my jewelry. Like, because I order so many rings and stuff like that. This is definitely going to come in handy for my jewelry because I don't actually own a jewelry box. All of my jewellery just gets stored in the same place and it's it's super messy. So this will be really nicely organised with all of my jewellery in it. I'm really happy with that. I'm really not mad at all. Oh. <laughs> this actually has handles on it, which I like because the other one that I ordered did not come with any handles. It wasn't like this. It was in one of my previous videos and it was just a white organiser with no handles I like it yeah my jewelry's gonna look really not hang on let me I've got some rings on that I got from Timu let me just put them in and see what they look like oh it looks so organized yeah I love that <laughs> I do love that I can't wait to start putting my jewelry in it I know it's really sad when you get to that point in life you get to that age where organization is everything <laughs> I mean I'm quite an organized person anyway in one respect um but yeah I, I do love a little bit of organization now now I'm getting older back in my 20s it didn't really matter so much but now <laughs> let's move on to the next thing that I got so I got these makeup brushes so these are basically the brushes in all of their element. Hang on. Okay. You get like a spoolie too. Not that I've got much eyebrow to use it on, but, you know, I could use it with my eyelashes. I, for me, like, it's a miracle if I get my si my sisters. Oh, my God. It's a miracle if I get my eyebrows to look relatively related let alone sisters next box here we go it feels like more storage let's have a little look what do we have let's cut without cutting ourselves that would be great i mean she packaged well i'm surprised that the box isn't mangled because normally they really are when you get from Timu. 
Wait, is that the same as I got already? Oh my god, did I order two? Oh no. So I ordered two of these by mistake, I think. Oh, that one's upside down. Hang on. <laughs> yeah, I, I must have ordered two by mistake. So I either need to buy more jewellery to fill this. That could be a challenge. <laughs> or um, I can give it to someone for their birthday or towards Christmas. I don't know. I might. See, I know what the problem is. I know what my issue is. I know that I've seen this now and I feel like it's a personal challenge to fill it. God damn it, Dest. I don't know why my brain brains like this, honestly. We will see. I might be able to talk myself out of it, but the problem is, can I? Can I really? <laughs> I could. I think I could probably use it for an abundance of things. I could find something to use it for. You know, I don't have to fill it with jewellery. I could use it for something else. If you have any ideas what I could use it for, stick it down below in the comments. It's not like I get any comments at all. So it would be nice to have a little bit of interaction, positive or negative. I don't mind. I'm all good. I'm very thick skinned. Let's get into what else I have in this bag. Oh, God, please don't. Please tell me I didn't order three. <laughs> uh, okay. I really hope I didn't order three because that is going to be like a nightmare. Oh, God, it looks similar. From first glance, it looks the same. Oh, no. Please tell me you slightly different. Even just a little bit different will do. Wait. Oh, okay. Okay, we're good. She's not the same. I think I may have got this one for some lipsticks. I'm not sure. But again, I will find something to put in it makeup wise because my makeup desperately, desperately needs arranging. But I like the fact that these have got little handles on. You can see what's in there. Easy accessible love that for me that is definitely going to be fantastic for my makeup I'm just going to have to put the empty box on the floor i'll sort it out afterwards so here i have a smaller one so at least thank god it's a different size you know i was starting to think oh my god did i order like five of the same thing let's have a little look and see what is in here Oh, I know what this is. This is for my makeup palette. Oh. So I got the, I think this is the large one. Uh, it doesn't actually say. Oh, wait, it says big on the box. Like, <laughs> it does actually say big on the box. So I assume that's the large one. I'll probably take a picture of that because I do find it mildly amusing that there's big on the box. Um, but yeah, I'm looking forward to using that because I have like a whole makeup cabinet over the other side of my room. I might do a short showing you it when it's all like put together again properly. But I do have a lot of different makeup and I have a lot of Jeffree Star stuff on display. Now, don't get me wrong. I'm not a massive fan of Jeffree Star um, with his personality and stuff like that. But he, there's no getting away from the fact that he does amazing makeup. Like, his makeup is some of the best I've tried. And I just, I do love his makeup. I don't support the person he is, but I really like his makeup line. So I do tend to buy his makeup when I can afford it. But I have noticed, like, Beauty Bay, they do quite a few of their own branded stuff, which is actually really, really good. And it's not a bad quality of makeup. So that's what I'm going to be using this for. 
um, my Beauty Bay palettes and my much cheaper palettes. But I do need them sort of stood somewhere where they're organised and don't look a mess. So what else do we have in here? Oh, my God. Oh, okay. Well, this one actually has a picture on the box. So let's have a look. Let's try and get in there. I always feel like I'm going to cut myself or something with these. Oh, my God. Y'all don't need that. None of us need that. Okay. All right. Let's have a little look at you. Oh, this is something I have to put together. No, Timu. <laughs> okay. So let's have a look. It's really big, actually. God. oh wow yeah that is real big hang on let me put this together and I'll come back and show you what it looks like put together all right so I'm almost finished putting it together I have a feeling I'm not going to be using this for my perfume though I have a feeling that I will be using it for something different um, there's a lot of organisation that needs to be happening here in this household. And I think that this will be perfect, maybe on my bedside table. Or I might even use it for organising the medicine cabinet. Uh, I'm not sure yet. We'll see. We will see, but I'm really, really not mad at this. It's actually way bigger than I thought it would be. Whereas usually I tend to buy things and they're smaller than I think. So this is 100% a win for me. The only issue I do have with it is it does have a, scrap, a couple of scratches, but I'm not going to whinge about them. I really like it. That is huge compared to what I thought it was going to be. Like, look at that. I'm really, really pleased with that. I honestly, honestly thought that that was going to be so much smaller. So I'm, yeah, I'm definitely pleased with that one. And I will find somewhere to use that. No doubt it will go on my bedside table, but you never know. Things could change by that point, and I might decide, no, actually, I don't want it over there. I want it in the medicine cabinet, or I want it in the bathroom. Oh, all my Lush product. Oh, no. Okay, stop, desk, behave. <laughs> Maybe I need to buy a new one for all my Lush products that I like to get. Oh. <gasps> Oh my goodness gracious. How stinking cute is this? So I remember ordering this and I was like, oh my goodness. I am so excited about this. Okay. Okay, oh, I really hope it's not broke. Ooh. Oh no, it's okay. <laughs> oh my god, I said that and I just went, oh no. Um, no, you have to put it together, so it's all good. It doesn't look damaged. There are all the parts that, yeah, there are all there. So this is like a turntable one. So obviously you can turn it round. Oh, I'm so, so excited about this. Does that go in there? Oh, it's that end that goes in there. And put it in. And then this end up here. Oh, look how cute that is. 
Oh my goodness gracious. Like, I'm so chuffed that I saw this because I just, oh my God, absolutely fell in love with it. You can even hang like necklaces and stuff from this bit or bracelets if you wanted to. I just love it. It's so unique. I've never, I've never seen anything like this. And this is why I bought it because I just thought it was so pretty. Like you don't even have to use it as a storage thing. You could put like flowers in here and then maybe some of those lights and have it as like something on display. I probably will put a few things in here, but I might use this part for flowers and lights depending. I'm not sure yet. I haven't made my mind up, but this is just so, so adorbs. It's gorge. I love it. I just, I can't get over that. I love it. I love it so much. Love it so much. That is going to be probably one of my favourite things from this order. It has to be. I just absolutely love it. What's next? Oh, okay. So people with long hair all over the world, this could save you. <laughs> it could save you from having to root around in your bathtub and try and get all the hair that's clogged in the sinkhole <laughs> or the bath hole, shower hole, whatever you want to call it, the plug hole. <laughs> um this will probably really come in handy for me because when I wash my hair, as you all know, if you've got long hair, you know, right? You, you lose hair. Even short-haired people lose hair in the shower. But it just comes in handy for having that as a, like a protective thing so you don't have to buy all these harsh chemicals to try and clear it. My mom uses hair removal cream down hers and I'm just like, I don't know if that's going to work for me. <laughs> I mean, it might do because I assume it breaks up the hair. But I'm going to let her test it first and then I will give it a go after. She see it somewhere and decided that it was a brilliant idea and she was going to do it. So I assume it's worked for her the last couple of times because she's not said anything. So, Oh! Let's have a little look at her. Well, actually, she's got a bit of weight to her already. I'm not overly mad at that. So that's what we're working with. You get like a little horseshoe on there and your heart. I like that. I like, I don't wear much jewellery, but when I do, I like to go all out. This may end up a choker on me because I've got that fat neck. Oh, wow. I really like that. Who is she? She's Vogue. <laughs> she not. <laughs> but I like it. That is actually very, very pretty. I'm very pleased with that purchase. What else have I got? It's like a lucky dip. Okay, I got some more brushes because I guess I kind of knew that the other brushes were going to be a little bit temperamental. So I got some more brushes. If I can actually get into them. <laughs> Oh, oh no, that's crazy. They're all sparkly in there. I love that. Okay. Brush test. Okay, no stragglers. It does need a little trim there though. Yeah, I've got... No, actually, they're, they're in good. All right, you, you do need to trim like a few of them because there's a few stray hairs. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that. But there's a... 
no, you're not going to be able to see. But there are a few little stray hairs there that do need a little trim down. And I will be doing that before using them because otherwise, like, I just, uh, it kind of annoys me having the stray hairs there. But I, I really like them. I, I just love how detailed they are. Like you've got that like little unicorn sort of horn effect there. And like, it's just, it's really pretty. I wasn't expecting them to be so glittery, to be honest. Maybe I just looked at them wrong on the website, but I was not expecting them to be that nice. Lucky dip. <laughs> Oh my god, okay, so I ordered a ring. I mean, it's cute from what I can see in the packaging, but it's a lot more sort of like yellow than I expected. <laughs> I mean, I'm not super mad. I will put a video in anyway. I'm not super mad, but it's real yellow. Like, oh, I don't know if I'm down with that. And you basically, so you get two rings. You put one in the other like that. I don't know if I like that gold colour. It's just... Mm, it's a bit too yellow for me, I think. Oh, it fits better on this finger. Yeah, it's a little bit too yellow. I mean, I like it, don't get me wrong. I love the style of it, but I'm not overly keen on how yellow the gold is, but I will wear it. I'll definitely wear it at some point. Um, I don't know for what occasion, though, but I will. I'll wear it. <laughs> I just, yeah, not overly thrilled at how, because on the website, it doesn't look that yellow. It kind of looks more of like a pale gold, if that makes sense. I don't know if I'm making any sense, but I'm trying to make sense. <laughs> it kind of looks more of a pale gold on the website, not like a real yellow, yellow gold. So, yeah, I'm a little bit disappointed with that, but it's not going to deter me from wearing it. I'm not so disappointed that I'll never wear it, so. Item of clothing. <laughs> so, I ordered, you remember the ghost face, uh, like, Halloween jumper with the, it was orange, the cold shoulder. After ordering that, I thought, oh my gosh. And obviously the ghost face shoes. I was like, oh my gosh, the clothes and the shoes aren't bad. So I ordered myself a couple of jumpsuits off there. This is the first one that I got. I'm probably not going to try it on right now <laughs> or even put a picture up. I want to save you having to look at that, but... Look how flared the legs are, though. That's giving me, like, night fever vibes. <laughs> A bit of John Travolta, you know? <laughs> I like it, though. I think that's going to look really nice with, like, maybe a white T-shirt underneath or, like, a black T-shirt or a black strap top. I like it. And it actually has pockets, too, so... Yeah, and they're, they're actually relatively deep pockets. So I will definitely be wearing that at some point. I've just got to wash it first. I'm real funny about that. I don't like putting things on unless they've been washed. And obviously it's going to need ironing and then hanging up. So no wrinkles will remain. But I really do like the colour of that. I think that it, the material doesn't feel like super cheap either. Let me have a little look actually before I move on to what the material is. <clears throat> what is the material? Where's the tag? 
Is the tag like in one of the legs, like low down? Hello! <laughs> Is it me you're looking for? Yes. Where are you? Go where you are. <laughs> Wait, I found it. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. 95% polyester and 5% elastane. Oh, okay. I mean, I'm not mad at that at all. It is a little bit sheer, though, now looking at it. I'll never get away with wearing, like, white underwear under it. It's going to have to be, like, grey. So it kind of matches. <laughs> grey panties. <laughs> Preferably ones that the elastic still works in and they don't keep falling down. <laughs> oh, my goodness gracious. But, yeah, I'm actually really quite pleased with that purchase i will wash them later and have them hung out to dry um i don't know what this is i don't remember what did i order sometimes i order stuff when i'm in bed like i'm just winding down from the day i see things i'm like oh i'll add that to my basket i'll add that to my basket I could do with that i'll add this i'll add that it looks like uh oh why no <laughs> they so stinking cute so i ordered some pink peach bags oh my goodness gracious enjoy your life yeah, I mean, I try. Timu helps. <laughs> these are cute. I ordered these for my bathroom because I hate having like a bin in the bathroom. I have, well, the toilet because I have a separate toilet and bathroom. So my toilet is probably like smaller than a box bedroom. It's literally like a, a small rectangle. <laughs> and it, I might have to show you one day what it looks like, but it's, these are going to be way better to have one of these hung up in the bathroom. One use thing to get rid of, you know. And they actually feel really good quality. I'm not... Sorry. I don't mean to, like, make loads of noise, but those that are into ASMR might like it. But I really... I like the design as well. They're actually really cute. Or say, like, you'd been to the shop for someone and you didn't want to, like, you haven't got loads of shopping. You've got your own little bag there. Like, if you're going to buy a couple of cans of cola or, you know, maybe a packet of crisps, a few sweets, put it in this bag, take it to cheer someone up. Maybe, oh, like a little tin of soup and a chocolate bar and like a little get well card or something you could put it in that kind of bag that's really sweet i like those i can't remember off the top of my head how many you get but i will put it with the price uh but yeah i like them and they're they're actually very good quality like you can feel it you know with some bags they're so thin and you think oh my god if i put like a couple of bottles of pop in that it's going to rip. These actually feel really, really strong. So I will definitely be using them if I only have a few little bits to get from the shop as well. There's quite a few there. I may even order some more if they're really good. Just so I have a few. A few lots put away. That was them. I really like those bags, actually. Oh, okay. <laughs> we have another necklace, but it's fell down in the bag. Let's get her out. Oh, this is like multiple. I mean, that's going to be a choker on me. I don't know if I dare put it on in case I sit here and it's like strangling me while I'm on camera. <laughs> I don't even know if that's going to fit my neck. I think you have to be like real slim for this, but sorry. I do really like that. 
I, I just ordered it on a whim because I thought, oh, that's real cute. I like that. Oh, I just, I don't think that was going to fit me. Oh, I don't know. I don't even want to test it right now because I'm sort of, oh, wait, oh, hang on. It will fit. Oh, my God. Does. I thought that it went on this part here because that's what it was hooked on. I didn't realise it had this. <laughs> that was my one moment of the day that you're forever going to love. So, yeah, that's... I actually really do like that. I hope it fits, but I'm not going to struggle with it on cam. I'm not going to struggle with it right now. I'm pretty sure I'll leave an update either at the end of the video or on the community tab on whether that fits or not. But yeah, I don't, I mean, this one fits perfect and it's not so much of a choker or anything. So and then the next thing I got is, I think it's like kitchen roll, but if I'm not mistaken, they're like, you can reuse it. I'm not sure what I would reuse it for, though. I just wanted to get it to test it out, like, to see what it was like. I would probably use it, like, you know when you wipe down the sides and you wash them down and then you spray with disinfectant? I'd probably use this for the disinfectant part so I could use it on multiple sides after they've been washed down. I think that's what it's intended for. Let's just... Because I'm, I'm curious now. I mean, it feels like a paper towel, but how are you meant to, um, <laughs> if anybody's tried this, it would be nice to know, like, actually, that's actually quite thick. So it's kind of like a, just making sure it hasn't got a weird smell or anything. It's, how can I explain it? It's kind of like slightly thinner than a dishcloth. Mm, that could come in handy though, definitely. That could 100%, and it's, I like the little cute designs that it's got. You can see them better from far away, but there's like a slice of lemon, um, watermelon, flowers. I like that. I mean, obviously it's a bit thin there because it was like, that's where I had to rip into it. But yeah, that's actually quite cute. I think if I'm not mistaken, my mum had ordered one of these too. She was like, oh, I'm going to get one and see what it's like. And I'm like, yeah, me too. <laughs> you know how you do. You're just like, yeah, me too. Let's go. Oh, okay. I know what these are straight away. These are for the remote controls and the phones in the household because two little darlings keep misplacing stuff at night. So they're like, oh, mum, I can't find my phone. I'm like, yeah, well, we're going to be putting them in certain places and they're going to remain in the bedroom slash living room that I have. So, yeah, you can fit like two phones in there couple of tv remotes and i got obviously the two pack because i need one myself so they'll have one for themselves i'll have one for myself and it just makes life easier i love the fact that it's i've got a thing about this clear um organization stuff i don't know why i don't know what it is i just think it looks really neat i don't know i don't know what it is but yeah, the organisation thing is definitely going to be brought into this household very quickly because we need it. <laughs> I don't know if that's it or not. No, it's not. Let me see if there's anything else in the bottom of this bag. Hello? Is there anything else in that? No. You probably see my bingo wing then shaking vigorously with the bag. So the last thing I have is another jumpsuit. It's just a comfort thing for me. I love a jumpsuit when I'm at home just chilling with the kiddos, doing the housework. 
this one's slightly different so this oh let me get you the right way this is what we're working with so it has a strap top it has the white at the top the v shape and then it's sort of like it's very long crotched very long so my crotch is literally going to go past my knees with these i've never had one like this but i thought i'd try it out it also has these pockets here which are again pretty deep i'm gonna give it a wash um and let it air dry but i'm just like <laughs> the crotch is literally <laughs> so low down i don't know if i'm gonna like it or not but we'll give it a go when I'm just like lazing around and stuff and chilling with the kiddos watching movies, that would probably be ideal. But I don't know. We'll see. Like, <laughs> I know it's like a bit of TMI, but you know, if you've got like a lot of things hold up your pants sometimes if the elastic's gone. I do have new pants, but sometimes, you know, those granny pants that are all comfortable, like the Bridget Jones pants, sometimes the elastic goes real quick. So for me, I need something that's going to hold them up. <laughs> and this is not it. But this this jumpsuit will be comfortable otherwise. So on that note, after embarrassing myself telling you about my granny pants, I'm going to make a move because that was literally the last thing. Um, but I hope you enjoyed the video. I've enjoyed spending time with you guys yet again. Uh, and I will see you in the next one. But before I go, before I go, there is a haul coming up that isn't actually a Timu haul. It is with another online, I want to say marketplace, because th I'm not sure if it's a marketplace or if it's like just an, a, another website uh, where you can order things. And I've decided or I had decided at the time that I would do what I got for £10 from this place versus what I got from uh, Timu for £10. So we're going to sort of compare in the next couple of videos. Hopefully you really enjoy them. And hopefully, fingers crossed, I get quite a bit for my money. I'm also thinking about if that goes down pretty well I might do what I got from this place for £20 versus what I got from Timu for £20 and under. So, yeah, we'll see how that goes. But until the next one, take care of yourselves. Bye. <laughs> she a choker and a half. <laughs> but I kind of like it. I'm not going to lie. I kind of like it. I'm joking. She's not that tight. Like, obviously, I can get fingers in there, so... Just influence me to lose some weight off my neck slash chins, you know? <laughs>